Welcome to DriveWise Cars, my name is Stephen and this is our stunning 2016 Mini 1 three-door hatchback. Finished in pepper white, the mileage is 38,903. It's had just one owner from new and it comes with the benefit and reassurance of a fully documented mini service history. The specification includes a pepper pack, 16 inch black victory spoke alloy wheels, black bonnet stripes, sun protection glass, media pack which includes satellite navigation along with a visual boost radio, visibility pack which includes a heated front windscreen, sports seats, black leather interior, a three spoke leather steering wheel and heated front seats as well. So without further ado let's have a closer look shall we? So we'll start off at the front then we'll take our time and meander down the passenger side just admiring the view as we go along with those beautiful 16 inch alloy wheels with the pepper pack the standard wheel size is 15 so these are an upgrade to 16s and don't they look gorgeous now this is just uh, just had the one owner a gentleman called William and I have to say it's a credit to him it's absolutely beautiful and we'll just take a moment to stop at the offside, a driver's side, and pause and admire those beautiful clean lines and those very pretty alloy wheels as we make our way slowly to the front where we started from. It's a long time since I've seen a Mini 1 with this level of specification. It truly is outstanding. So that's the outside. Let's have a look on the inside now, shall we? So we'll pop the driver's door open, we'll check out the door card, make sure that's in good order, and it most certainly is. And we can see there we've got switches there for the electric windows, a toggle switch for the door mirrors. Then we've got beautiful sports seats with black leather interior. The driver's seat is height adjustable using that lever. And there's also leg support if you want to pull that out as well. Now I'll pop inside. We'll have a close look of what's going on. So here we've got the three sport leather steering wheel. Uh, sitting above that, we've got the speedometer, the rev counter next door to that. And if I just press that little button, it confirms the mileage for us at 38,903. If you don't mind, I'll just start the engine up. There we go. So we'll come over to the center of the dashboard now. And here we've got the visual boost radio system. So once it's uh, warmed itself up, there we go, we'll go to the beginning and start off with some of the features. So we've got satellite navigation, just wait for the map to pop up. There we go, oh, it's set on a different setting. So we've got an interactive map as well, there we go, then we'll go back to the home screen. So you can choose your favourite radio stations, there's FM, AM and DAB, and you can blue your telephone, Bluetooth your telephone, I beg your pardon, just there. But the bit I like best is this bit, the vehicle information section. So if you look at vehicle status and click on there. We've got a tight pressure monitoring system, so we can see at the moment that all four wheels are in green, which is exactly what we want. If, for example, you were to lose air out of one of the tyres, you get a warning on the dashboard. You go into this screen and it'll show exactly which wheel needs attention. Then we come back down here to the service requirements section. It lets us know when any major um, work is due to be carried out on the engine. So we've got an engine oil change in 8,000 miles or in August 2022. A brake fluid service in August next year. A vehicle check in August 2024 or 22,000 miles. And we click on the service history section. It shows us all of the services that have been carried out. So the first one was in January 2018 at 13,528. And this isn't the mileage, this is the code for the dealer that carried out the work. 
as we can see all the way up to the top it's the same dealer so we've got a rear brake new rear brake pads then then in August 18 at 17,300 we've got an engine oil and a microfilter service in August 2019 another a brake fluid service I beg your pardon in August 20 we've got an engine oil vehicle check microfilter and air cleaner carried out then in August 2021 at 38,000 and 36 so just under 900 miles ago front brake pads and a brake fluid service carried out and we'll go back to the home screen now sitting below that we've got the master control panel for the heating and ventilation system so on the left hand side you've got temperature the right hand side for the driver's side the middle is the fan speed and then we've got a bank of switches across the bottom so here we've got the heated passenger seat fast demist switch that off heated front windscreen heated rear windscreen air conditioning maximum air conditioning and of course heated seat for the driver and it's not just one setting there's three lights there because you have three different settings then underneath that I'll just switch the engine off now we've got the master switch for the engine to switch it on and off then sitting underneath that we've got a USB and an auxiliary port twin cup holders a six-speed manual transmission and coming back here this is the master control panel for the visual boost radio system so that's the view from the driver's seat now if you want to let somebody in the back you can do it's dead straightforward on the back of the seat the driver's seat there's a lever just stretch in pull that forward and your passengers can gain access to the sumptuous leather upholstery in the back and coming round to the rear now where the mini badge is if we just press that you can hear a, a bump that opens the tailgate for us and we've got a 60 40 split rear seat arrangement so you can fold either or both of those down which gives you a lot more storage space and we have a secret compartment so we have a solid panel here but that will lift up and give you even more storage space and just pop that back down close the tailgate then we'll come back down the near side the passenger side again i always like to check the door cards just to make sure they're in good order and they most certainly are the passenger side is too and again the front passenger seat with that lovely leather interior trim and the seat is also height adjustable just like the driver's side and again if you want to let people into the back from the passenger side just stretch over pull the handle forwards and there you go so i hope you're impressed so far i most certainly am so here we've got a 2016 Mini One three-door hatchback with pepper pack, media pack, sport seats, full leather interior, heated seats, three-spoke leather steering wheel, 16-inch alloy wheels. It's had just the one owner from new, William, and it comes with a fully documented mini service history. Now, once I finish the video, our team will come in, they'll COVID secure the interior, so they'll cover the steering wheel, handbrake and gear stick. So it's all ready for you to come and inspect safely. My name's Stephen. I hope you've enjoyed the video and I look forward to speaking to you soon.